Hey guys, tired of terrible audio on your iPhone? I know I am. I'm going to show you how you can hook up an external microphone to an iPhone 11. You can get rid of the wind noise by using an external microphone. You're going to improve the audio quality by using an external microphone. And a little bonus thing you might not be aware of, it then allows you to use your iPhone as a voice recorder for doing voiceovers. So you don't have to go out and spend a couple hundred dollars on a voice recorder. You can use your iPhone quite simply. So let me show you how we're going to do this. All right, let's jump right into hooking this up. I had to order in a couple of parts to be able to make this work. Basically, this one is a lightning to headphone jack. So let me just open that one up. You get your standard little instruction book. No sticker though. Oh well. And you get this massive little cable here. Now this has a lightning adapter on it because the iPhone 11 does not have a headphone jack. This cable gives me that capability. So that will plug in to the iPhone like that. Now for a microphone, they are a TRS ending most times. You can get specific microphones for iPhones that are the TRRS, but the microphones I have, they're not designed for a cell phone. They're designed for audio recording devices, cameras. So I need an adapter to go between this, which is a TRRS, to a TRS. That's what this Rode cable does. It does the change from the two. Wasn't too much, I bought this on Amazon. And again, another massive cable. But on here, you can see how it changes. This is TRRS, and it's tip ring ring sleeve versus tip ring sleeve. That's what they stand for. So this will simply plug into there, and there we go. We can hook this up to any of the TRS microphones now and have it record on here. So let me just open my phone up, get rid of that, get rid of that, bring that up, switch to that. Let's grab this cable here, and we simply Plug that into there. Now, the audio you're hearing is coming from this microphone. If you're wondering where the microphone is, it's basically right here. It's my Sony lavalier style microphone. You can see it's that mic that's being used, but I had it hid just underneath the clothing. Now, I can use it like this, which is fantastic. The audio, as you can see, is not too bad. This is the same mic that I used on the Osmo Pocket. Works great on my cell phone as well. Because if you're out and about and only have your cell phone with you and you have this mic with you, then you can improve your audio on your video from your cell phone. The audio is not bad on the cell phone, but it's not the greatest. The audio through this mic is a lot better. Also, I can put a dead cat on this microphone so I don't have to worry about any wind noise because the iPhone, again, the mic is exposed. Any exposed mic is subjected to wind noise. We can protect this with a dead cat. Now, I'll link a video down below where I showed you how to create different dead cats and one specifically for a lavalier style, which I use for here. I don't have it on here now because I'm in the studio and there's no wind from it. But that's how well this microphone works with the iPhone. Now, you do have different options for recording your audio. You, if you're doing video, then you are just be talking into it with the microphone, which is perfect. But what happens if I wanna do a voiceover? I'm using this camera that you're seeing me from, but I need the audio from this camera because I can't run or boom a mic. Well. Why can't we use the iPhone as a voice recorder? There's a lot of different voice recorder apps available. If you don't want to play with any of those, then simply set your iPhone on video, hit record, 
and you're recording the audio. That's fantastic. So I don't need to go out and spend, say, a couple hundred dollars on a voice recorder to jack this mic into to then voice over. I can use what I already have. The audio is good. And this is basically just running it from video on here. Now, you can get apps. There's a bunch of different apps available. I'll let you guys go through and sort them out. There's quite a few. You have GarageBand that comes with this as well, which is an audio editor and, and everything else. So there's a lot of options there for playing with your audio with what you already have. So if you're just starting out on YouTube or just starting out creating videos and you want to improve your audio without really spending much money, well, this mic's about 10 bucks. A couple of bucks, there's 10 bucks for the lightning cable and I think it was 15 or $20 for the road cable. That's it. Using this as a voice recorder saved me well over a couple hundred dollars. Now I can use this audio and do an overlay on the video from that camera when I can't boom a mic. Now normally I use my uh, Taxstar microphone which is like right here on me but there's a lot of times and you've seen in some of the videos where my audio has got a bit echoey because I can't run a microphone that far. Well, this will solve that solution because I can just simply slip this in my back pocket, run the wire down my shirt, tape this on to me so you don't see it at all. Boom, way improved audio. So those echoey audio issues for me should now be resolved. I also did pick up an, uh, an extension cable, uh, a 10 foot road for my microphone so I can get a greater distance, so I can boom that mic in and in some scenarios it'll work. Other times I'm shooting too wide in here, even though it's not the greatest and widest studio, that I can't boom without that stuff showing in the video. Well, this now gives me an option to create audio that I can simply lay over on here. I just have to sync the audio up, put it together, and do it all in post. There you go. Simple solution to hook an external microphone up to your iPhone, specifically for me, the iPhone 11, and I can use it as a voice recorder. If you guys have any questions or comments, please leave it down below. If you're new to this channel, please subscribe, hit that bell notification so you're aware when I post new videos. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. So, until the next time.